In this tutorial, I'll show you how to create CRT effect in Premiere Pro. Let's get to it. Here we are in Premiere. I've got this video as the example without any effect. So in order to create CRT effect, we are going to open effects window and search for several effects in a specific order. The first one is grid. Then drag and drop the grid onto the video. Then open effect controls panel. Then under the grid, set size from to width and height sliders. Then set width and height both to five, border to two. Then set color to black and blending mode to multiply. Next effect is noise, search for noise. It will be under noise and grain, drag and drop it onto the video. Then set amount of noise to 20% or so. Then search for VR digital glitch, also add it to the video. Scroll this down, open distortion settings and set everything except color distortion to zero. And then adjust the color distortion to your liking. I'm going to set mine to 10 to get slight RGB splitting. Then comes lens distortion. Under the lens distortion, set curvature to 30 to distort the image around the edges. Then search for transform and increase the scale until you don't have any gaps in the image. So 125 works fine for me. And then comes Gaussian blur. Set blurriness to 5 to slightly soften and blur the image. And lastly, we have Lumetri color. Open basic correction settings. And set exposure to 2 to brighten up the scene. Then scroll down to curves settings and create a simple S curve by adding a point over here, dragging this one up. Then add a point over here and drag this one down. Then switch to blue channels and slightly increase that to give everything a tint of blue. And after that, we can do the preview. And here we have the CRT effect. If you want to save this as a preset, you go back to the effect controls panel. Make sure you're selecting the video. Let's minimize all of the effects one by one. So we can see all of them. Then hold control and select all of the effects. Make sure all of them are selected. Then right click on any of them. Select save preset. Give this a name you like. I'm going to call mine CRT preset. Then you click OK. And then next time you search for that preset in effects window. So CRT preset. You can see I have one over here. So let me delete these effects. You can see the video does not have any CRT effect. So I'm just going to drag and drop this preset onto the video and we get that same CRT effect that we created. So you don't have to create this effect from scratch every time. You just save it as a preset and you can use whatever you want. So thank you guys for watching.